did you raise your daughter? Very honest ako sa kanya. I don't keep secrets para ganun din siya sa akin, Tito Boy. Magsasabi rin siya sa akin ng kung ano yung totoo. Oo. Mm -mm. Paano mo naman pinalaki ang iyong ina? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, um, kasi, di ba, that's the misconception na parang pag single mom, um, very protective sila sa anak nila, mas um, parang nagiging um, shield sila sa mundo. Pero I feel like Nung pinalaki ko yung nanay ko, <laughs> I feel like in some way, naging ganun din ako sa mama ko. Kami yung naging sandala ng isa't isa. So, kahit na hindi man lang, hindi aminin ng mom ko, pero may times na kinailangan din niya maging uh, vulnerable, maging weak. ba diba? There are times, hindi ka naman pwede palaging maging strong. Hala, bakit ako naiiyak? <laughs> my, my mom, there were times na ako yung naging malakas para sa aming dalawa. And I Kailan like, yung mga panahon na yun? Um, a few, <laughs> a few times. I mean, nobody has a perfect life, de ba? So right. I feel like may times na naman namin pinagdadaanan yung mom ko. So I feel like yun yung relationship mm -hmm. namin is kumukuha kami ng lakas sa isa't isa. Tama yung tanong. You know, without realizing, sometimes mm -hmm. we also raise our parents. Actually, opo. Mm -hmm, no? <laughs> yes, po. Oh, oh. Yes. Paano mo ni raise si Isabel na walang galit sa kanyang biological father, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. si Senator Lito Lapid. Apo. Pa paano mo ginawa yun? Um, in fairness naman kasi, Tito Boy, yung biological dad niya, ano naman, naging mabuti naman po kasi talaga sa, ano, sa kanya. Lalo na nung, nung time na noon pa, nung kami pa, very, ano po siya noon, very, always present siya eh. Very hands-on siya actually. Mm -mm. So... Hindi, hindi, hindi naman din ako yung tipo na maninira at wala rin naman akong dapat isira kasi mabait naman po yung tao. How old were you when, uh, you know, your, your parents separated? Fifteen. Yeah, I was around fifteen. Fifteen years old. Mm -hmm. So, pa paano? Did you ask questions? Anong ginawa mo? I asked a lot of questions. You did? I'm sure. I did. And I'm sure. Siguro what helped was my mom answered them all. And she was very honest with me. And if my mom was the type na itatago niya sa akin yung totoo, kung ano man yung totoong nararamdaman niya, hindi ko siguro maiintindihan dito, boy. Pero dahil naging tapat po siya sa akin, naiintindihan ko po. And mas, mas nag-root po ako sa mama ko na, Mami, mas kailangan mo maging masaya. What were you trying to tell her when she was saying, bakit kayo naghiwalay? Uh, mm -hmm. How are you feeling, mom? Um, I had to be honest lang, Tito Boy. So, sinabi ko sa kanya, yung, the kind of relationship that I had with her father, my lifespan lang yon. Yeah. Uh, I did not see myself growing old with him because we all know that he has his own family. Okay. Yeah. So, i, parang I felt na it has to, ano na rin, it, na, na reach na niya yung, yung lifespan niya. Okay. And, Ano, um, um, very happy ako kasi nagkaroon ako ng Isabel. Yes. So, oh. naiintindihan yun ng anak ko. How was that journey, Michelle? Without having to intrude too much, you made that choice. Wala ka bang pangamba na hindi ka mauunawaan ng anak mo? Na pumasok ka sa isang napakakumplikadong relasyon? Mm -hmm. Oo. Because you made that choice. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oo. Um, hindi po. Kasi Isabel grew up knowing also that her father also has okay. a family din talaga na tunay. Mm -mm. Opo. Ang importante ang naririnig ko, hindi ka, hindi kayo nagsinungaling. Hindi po. Hindi po.